the grade four math practice test for T in ready. Question number nine, which of the following numbers are prime? Select the three correct numbers. Now to get this correct, you have to understand what prime numbers are. Prime numbers have a specific definition. First, they have to have two unique factors, which is to say they have to be divisible by two numbers. And those unique factors need to be one, or one if you'd prefer that, and itself, whatever its value is, which means one itself is not a prime number because it doesn't have two unique factors. It only has one factor, which is itself. So it meets half the criteria, but not the other half, just FYI. So I need to look to see, are any of these numbers divisible? Like, can I come up with numbers, uh, even if I skip count or I'm doing multiples lists or whatever that uh, can work. So one and two, well, that's looking pretty good, right? So my only group set here are these two. So this is a prime number. So I'm good with that one. For nine, not so easy. One and nine is definitely something, but also three times three is nine, correct? So that's another set. So this is not a prime number. 13, one, 13, and nothing because two doesn't work, three doesn't work, uh, because it goes three, six, nine, 12, and then up to 15. Um, four doesn't work, so we're out. So 13 is a prime number. 15 has one and 15, but I even said it a second ago, three, six, nine, 12, 15. So three is a factor of 15, and it's three times five. So this is not a prime numbers composite. And then finally, with 19, 1 and 19, you can try, if you don't really know, just try your numbers. Try 2, 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20. See, that's 19 is not in there. 3, 6, 9, 12, 15, 18, 21. Yeah, so, so 3 doesn't work. 4 doesn't work. 4, 8, 12, 16, looking good, 20. Nope, that's out. Five's out, six is out. So none of the other ones work. So you end up with 19. So remember, we're near doing, and, and really generally speaking on these types of tests, I should have said, um, if you did your multiples of two, three, and five, and you don't find it, it's probably going to be a prime at this grade level, but you know, whatever, choose wisely. Occasionally four will work, but two will work if four works. Um, but remember, for your prime, you need two unique factors. One has to be one of those factors, and the number itself has to be the other factor. Otherwise, it is not a prime number.